How to Remove Melted Nylon from Iron Have you ever found yourself in the frustrating situation where you've accidentally melted nylon or fabric onto your iron? It's a common mishap, but don't worry, it's not the end of your iron's life. Here's how you can easily remove the melted nylon and get your iron back in working order. First, let's start by heating the iron to a warm or medium setting. This will help soften the melted nylon, making it easier to remove. Be careful not to make it too hot, as this could damage the iron or make the nylon even more stubborn. Once the iron is warm, use a metal spatula to gently scrape off as much of the melted nylon as possible. Be gentle to avoid scratching the iron's surface. This step is about removing the bulk of the nylon, so don't worry too much about the smaller particles yet. Next, unplug the iron and let it cool down a bit. Then, place ice cubes and water in a shallow pan and sit the iron in it, ensuring only the base with the debris is in contact with the cold water. Let it sit for about five to 10 minutes. The cold temperature will help the remaining nylon freeze, making it easier to scrape off. After the nylon has frozen, remove the iron from the water and use the spatula again to scrape off the frozen debris. This should help remove most of the remaining nylon. If there are still some particles left, you can try using a different method. Lay a damp terry cloth towel on your ironing board and rub the hot iron over it vigorously. This can help loosen and remove the remaining residue. Alternatively, you can sprinkle some table salt on the towel and rub the iron over the salt. The abrasive nature of the salt will help scrub off the melted nylon without damaging the iron. Another effective method involves using waxed paper and salt. Lay a sheet of waxed paper on the ironing board, sprinkle some salt on it, and then rub the hot iron in a circular motion over the salted waxed paper. This combination of the abrasive salt and the smooth waxed paper can effectively remove the melted nylon. For any remaining film or residue, run the iron over an old cloth several times. If the residue persists, you can wet the cloth and continue ironing over it until the film is completely gone. To prevent this from happening again, it's a good idea to keep wax paper and an old cloth by your ironing board. Before ironing any fabric, run the iron over the wax paper and then the old cloth to remove any small debris that might be stuck to the iron. By following these steps, you should be able to remove the melted nylon from your iron and have it back in good working condition. Remember to always be careful when handling hot irons and to clean your iron regularly to avoid any future issues.